Yeah, but it's the old fella back who's new here, old Mr. B, whatever you want to call me. Um, yeah, Gary Holloway's uh, artwork. It's a bit big, but uh, in my next, uh, when I move, um, you'll see it better. Um, yeah, Bandmade in Houston. Chatting can army time. Right. Uh, and this was put up by uh, live fan, cam fan cams. Thank you very, very much for that. Information is all down below as usual. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, this is a, a bit of a little gripe. This is what annoys me. People that own guitars, right? Like my neighbour. Got a guitar, acoustic guitar. Okay, I'm not into acoustic. But oh, the way he treats it and doesn't look after it, it's awful. It's absolutely awful. So, so I got it off of him and I've, I've cleaned it up because uh, he's on about the action. The action's fine because it, the thing was obviously kept it like in the cold, damp place. As soon as it got into normal room temperature, <clears throat> the action went back to where it should be, which is how near the strings are to the fret. And uh, and I've restrung it for him and that and, and set it up. It, it, it just annoys me. Well, if you're going to have a guitar, look after it. Please, please look after them. Um, this is what I was thinking of doing a live stream on how I set up guitars, how to look after one, how just to maintain it, just to keep it keep it right. And um, you know, when you take it out, take it out in a bag if you're going to gig with it, because I mean, it does things like that. And you know, calls yourself a musician, but musicians look after the equipment. But that's my gripe of the day, shall we say? Um, but uh, but yeah, it's um, it's one of them things. So he. he it just annoys me, you know. Um, it's like, okay, I've got a lot of guitars and I take... Some days I'll just spend days cleaning them, polish them and doing... You know, it's just what you do, isn't it? And uh, But you look after them. I mean, okay, you, you got wear and tear for the gigging, but you still look after them. And uh, that's the main thing, because... Um, or or if you're in a band, you've got a guitar tech to do it for you. Um, but mainly, you know, if you've got your guitars at home and... Your strings are too far away and things like that. This is why I was thinking of doing a live stream to sort of say to people, look, this is how easy it is. You don't have to go and pay money out, you know, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70 pounds or dollars, whatever, to get someone to do it for you. You can do it yourself. Anyway, enough for me rabbiting on about that. <clears throat> this is uh, this is bandmade again. And this is Konami, as it says here, uh, chatting. This will be interesting. Anyway. Let's uh, nip here. <laughs> there you go. Now that, there's Gary Holloway's artwork. You can see that much better there, can't you? Much, much better. And what am I putting these on for? Because <clears throat> ah! that's the House of Blues. Um, anyway, what am I doing? I'm losing it, aren't I? I'm completely losing it. Let's, let, let's, uh, let's get them up here first. There you go. There you go. <clears throat> And TikTok, let's chatty rock. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> 
says this is absolutely marvelous the trouble they're going to <coughs> konami's got a phone to get the translation right and everything and all the rest of it this is absolutely marvelous the, and and psyche's there and i'm glad psyche's there because the, the crowd are overpowering uh, konami's little voice if you like but uh, uh psyche thinks i'll get them you know she's more powerful voice she'll say but absolutely great. This this is something. This is something that you've, I've not seen with any other band, where where they got talking and and Psyche's really coming out of herself now as well and getting used to it. and and they're they're teaching teaching us if you like um, Japanese words, but it's it's so much fun what they're doing. They've they found a, a real genuine way to communicate with the with the audience, which is brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. And I don't know any other band like it. And, you know, you can get English-speaking bands, but they don't communicate with the crowd like that. And, I mean, it's like psychic. She'll point people out in, in the crowd and things. Absolutely fabulous. They really, really are fabulous. They are. There's no other band like it in the world, as far as I'm concerned. I'm really, really... And anyway... Anyway, I'm rabbiting on again because they're just marvellous. Absolutely brilliant. Right, so what you need to do now then is to get over to uh, Live Fan Cam's uh, channel and check them out, what else they've done as well, because the link will be down below. Go and check them out. Absolutely awesome what they're doing. They're putting up some, they're putting up some gold stuff, if you like. This is, this is something you don't see. This is why I'm not reacting to the music, because this is all, this is all new. You know, we, we, know, we know the music. We know how good they are live. But to see this, to see how they are, is absolutely brilliant. It really, really is. And um, anyway, so are all you people. And I just like to say thank you, thank you, thank you. I've gone on a bit too long today with complaining at the start. <laughs> thank you for all your comments, all your support, and everything else. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And of course, please, please, please stay safe. And this old fella will be back. Bye for now. <laughs>